<laughs> We're back on a Wednesday morning. Take you back 1973. 90 million viewers wow. tuned in to see the legendary battle of the sexes between tennis legends Billie Jean King and Bobby Riggs. As you probably know, Billie Jean won a victory not just for her but for women everywhere. Yes. And now the story of that epic match is heading to the big screen and Billie Jean King is here and I have to say we are all geeking out. We are geeking <laughs> in your presence. <laughs> Geeks rules. <laughs> What did you think when you learned they were going to make a movie? Because it's not just about the match. It's about more than that. No, no, in a lot no, of ways, it's so personal. No, it's, it's everything. It's deep. It's deep. But it's funny, too. It's, it's got some funny moments, very tense moments. Uh, but the, the Battle of the Sexes, the movie, really caught the essence. And Emma Stone, of course, Okay. <laughs> do, I, do I need to say anything else? Yeah. Emma Stone uh, is going to play you. Ex I said, what? I was like so excited. Um, so it, this is the anniversary today. I played, I played exactly oh, cool. September 20th, wow. 1973. So this is like a 44th anniversary. Wow. We were talking about this match in a commercial break the other day, and, and one of the younger members of our team here, Dylan, uh, <laughs> said, she, she said, was it a huge deal back oh, then? Wow. 90 I think million people For said. people who didn't live through it, they maybe can't understand how yeah. captivating this was. No, they can't. It's, yeah. it, it was impossible. Um, it was so emotional. Title IX had just been passed the year before, uh, June 23rd, 1972, which was a very important piece of legis legislation. Because before that, uh, when federal governments, uh, the federal government would give money to the high schools or colleges or, or uh, in private or public, doesn't mm -hmm. matter, or universities, it's like they had to do it equally for the first time in 1972. Mm -hmm. That is the essence. It was about education. And they had an afterthought of physical activity. So a woman never got an athletic scholarship until after that. Mm -hmm. And before that, it was classroom quotas. Wow. Like if you want to be a doctor at Harvard, for instance. 5% before 1972 wow. of the wow. class were women. That's why there were no women doctors and lawyers. And now there's more women in medical school and law school than men. Right. But that goes back to 1972 and Title IX, and everyone needs to understand it. It's only 37 words. Everybody can handle to read this. I know they want to read only about three words now, but <laughs> no, you, too, you know, focus a little yeah. bit longer. Yeah. You can do this. You can do this. What was the relationship like in real life with you and Bobby Riggs? Because it seemed like you guys were jovial and had fun together. But well, were I you did. friends? Really? No, not up to, but I, um, I love history. Yeah. I knew all about it, and I knew he had been deprived uh, during his prime during World War II. He won the Triple Crown, which is singles, doubles, and mixed at Wimbledon. And then the war came, the Second World War, mm -hmm. and so he never got the attention that he craved. Wow. So here's his moment where he is just can't get enough. Yeah. And I understood that about him. And uh, I respected him so much because he was one of my heroes that I think that's the reason I beat him because I respected him, did my homework. Uh, it was ready. We just have a few seconds because we could talk to you for hours. Yeah. But is there one thing that is like your most distinct memory from the match itself? An image. You know that I have a hard time remembering much. It's probably when he jumped the net and he said, uh, "I underestimated you," wow. because my dad taught my brother and I. My my br younger brother Randy Moffat played 12 years of professional baseball. Uh, most of those years, a pitcher with the San Francisco Giants, good slider. So, <laughs> <laughs> they, they, my dad emphasized, you you always respect your opponent yeah. even if you don't like him, and you always never ever underestimate them. So when he said that, I went, oh, I can't wait to tell Daddy. Ah. Sweet. That is Billie so nice. Uh -huh. Billie Jean King. How was his change-up, by the way, your brother? Good change-up. <laughs> no, he, he really relied on the slider muscle. <laughs> <laughs> but, I like a good slider. Yeah. Yeah. I love it. Great to yeah, have you. I'm with you there. And by the way, we want to tell people you're going to be back with Hoda and Kathy yeah, yeah, a little I'll later this morning. Yeah, yeah. And Battle of the Sexes hits theaters on Friday. We're back in a moment. This is today on NBC. Thank you. Thanks. That was fun. That was fun. Good.